Christmas. This Christmas. What do you get? Someone who has everything and more. He can heal the sick, so don't give him an aspirin. He can walk on water, don't keep him off the floor. Every time you hear a bell, an angel burns in hell. If the Lord were alive today, what would you give him this Christmas? Give him a twenty dollar gift certificate at Pizza Joe's. Merry Christmas from Pizza Joe's. <laughs> and now back to the joyous sounds of Christmas. All I want for Christmas is my two front eyes. All I want for Christmas. I don't is my know. Two oh, for goodness sake, do whatever he wants so he won't scream anymore. But, Mom, I'm all the way over. Praise the Lord. We're here. All I want for Christmas is my two front eyes, but I haven't been a good enough boy. <laughs> I'd like to wish a very special first Merry Christmas to our Jews for Jesus friends. You know, during this joyous season, it is easy to forget the true meaning of Christmas. What Christmas is really about is the birth of the cute little baby who would grow up to die an unbelievably horrible death for our sins. You know who I'm talking about. Jesus. Jesus our Savior, born from an attractive virgin named Mary. Jesus was an unplanned birth that really made a name for itself. Why, if Joseph refused to let the baby grow within Mary, who knows what this building would be right now? Maybe even a synagogue. <gasps> but because Joseph had the moral goodness to raise the surprise, we are safe and warm here in a Protestant church. Amen and Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Churchy. Reverend Putty? Yes, Oral? I agree with you that it was good that they didn't kill the baby Jesus before he was born. Oh, you think so, Captain? Uh-huh. But it's still too bad that grown-up Jesus had to die, even though he wasn't as cute. Oh, he'll be back. Really? Yep. In fact, he may already be here. There might be a little child right now running around somewhere who's the second coming. Cool, the second coming. But this time, he won't be as nice. I don't know. Sorry, Shape. Bye, Reverend. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Oral. Mm -hmm. There we go. One last touch. Can I this year, Dad? Hmm. Well, I suppose you're old enough. Mmm. It smells like a whole forest of lemons and hairspray. Mmm. That it does. Okay, time for bed, boys. Santa's coming soon, and he knows kids who stay up late are jerks. No! So I'll tend to your brother. And try to keep him quiet, or he'll wake the neighbors. Yes, Mom. Good night. Good night. No! Are you decent? Hold on. Okay. Well, that was a mortifying sermon today. Oh, come on. Can't we have one good night? You know the Reverend was referring to you not wanting Shapey. That's ridiculous. How would he even know? Don't be an idiot. Everyone knows you didn't want him. Yeah, well, I had my reasons. I think it's kind of strange that I don't even remember conceiving this kid. Please, when do you ever remember? All I do is try to forget. At least you know he's yours. Please, God, let this be the best Christmas ever. Amen. Oh. And if Jesus is already back here on Earth, please tell him to come by so I can meet him. I'm sure you know he's been my personal hero for years now. Amen again. Gosh, if Jesus is around and nobody knows it, he'll be all alone on his birthday. and That's just not right. 
Hmm. I better go ask Dad. See what he thinks I should do. How did we even get here? Look, just get over it. How can I get over it? I never asked for a second child, and then boom, Shapey magically appears. Explain that. Shapey. But this time, he won't be as nice. Behold, the second coming of our Lord. Hallelujah! Oh, he doesn't even look anything like me. <gasps> Who's been inside you? You are disgusting. I want a divorce. Fine. I'm gone. Live it up, baby! Golly, this is going to be the best Christmas ever. Yay! Christmas morning! Merry Christmas and happy birthday, First Jesus! And thanks for making my little brother the second you! Mom! Dad! It's the best Christmas ever! Uh, I have something important to tell you! Hey! Open up! You have to hear the good news! Oh well. I, I guess it can wait. I shall drum for you. Drum, drummy drum. For the newborn baby king. Dada! Yes, Lord. <laughs> Thank you, Savior. What's the new plan? Present, present, present. Maybe you should put on some... Lead the way, Lord. I follow. If the Lord were alive today... <coughs> What's the matter, Master? No present. Oh, well, Mom and Dad aren't up yet, so... Hmm... If the Lord were alive today, what would you get him this Christmas? <gasps> Come on, Lord, get dressed. I'll get you a present. No! Okay, okay, Christ child. Just wait out here. Yay, win! No! Shapey? La, 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 la. Look, Shapey, I... The apocalypse begins. Yay! Don't be people. The Christ has spoken. Take that, heathen. Mrs. Puppington, Reverend Putty here. Merry Christmas. Speaking of Christmas... What are you two doing? <laughs> Mom, guess what? Dad isn't Shapey's father. I know that, Oral. Then you figured it out. Are Shapey's the second son of God? <laughs> I wish God was his father. Uh, well, where's Dad? He left home. We're splitting up. But it's Christmas. We can't spend it without him. Then I suggest you go find your precious father and the two of you spend Christmas together. If the Lord were alive today, what would you give him this Christmas? What do you give someone who has everything and more? He can heal the sick cold.
Oh, cheer up, Clay. You've got a great family. You're an incredibly attractive guy, and your wife is automatically sexy by association. And Oral is one of the best long-distance runners on my team. Who cares if your second kid was a mistake and won't let himself be weaned? At least he's cute. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. She'll never go through with the divorce. Thanks, Danielle. Sometimes I wish I could put your brain in my wife's head. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Clay. Merry Christmas. What would you give him this Christmas? Give him a $20 gift certificate for Pizza Joe's. Mm -mm. Boy, God. This sure didn't turn out to be the best Christmas ever. But you still have two minutes left, and I have faith in you.